Hello. Hey. I'm Cindy. And I'm Debbie. We're sisters in stitches and stitches we do have tonight. Lots oh, of Oh, she's so witty. <laughs> what is the matter with you? She, she must be on painkillers for her leg. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm just being goofy. Anyway, this is our Dia. I hate the way she says it. When she first started getting this box, I don't know, a couple of years ago, she did. We do the videos, and she go. So this is my Dianco, and I'm like, what? <laughs> she goes, Dianco, D and I said, Dianco, Dia and Co, Dia and Co, and it's actually Dio, Dia and Company. No, it's not. It's it is now Dia and Dia dot com. Oh. It's Dia. Well, anyway, and Co. it is Dia and Co. Dia. We'll just call it. But Dia. She goes. She would say Dianco. <laughs> like she just like <laughs> saying it like that. It doesn't even sound good. All right, let's get down to my stitches. All right, what I like about Dia is that their Dianco. prices, <laughs> their prices are lower than Stitch Fix. So let's see what I not I've much got. in this box, and you're gonna be quite surprised. Yeah, all right, I did not look at the prices because I feel that it influences the decisions on whether or not I like a top. So. Um, uh, the first thing I got are from Mark New York. Is that the, the is that Mark Jacobs? Mark New York? I don't know. Well, anyway, it's Mark New York's and it's like their active wear, performance wear. And they sent me a, a shirt, some short shorts. <laughs> Who wear short shorts? Not, not her. <laughs> no. And they are just um, like the sweatshirt material. Not me either. Which would have been fine if they would have been longer because I really don't have any and they would have been nice to wear to work out with a pair of my bike shorts underneath. Yeah, not at $55 a pair. No way. Yes way. First, these have got to be Marc Jacobs. Is Marc New York and Marc Jacobs the same thing? I don't know. I don't know either. I can look at my phone while you're talking. No, that's okay. That's okay. Uh, so I'm not keeping a pair of $55 shorts because you know what I could do? I have so many sweatpants, I could just cut them off. True. Right? Like we used to do with our jeans, remember? We would get so, get all the holes and they look like they look nowadays. And then we couldn't wait because then we'd cut them off and then we'd fringe we'd it. We'd roll them like they did in, um, what was that movie? Um, Nobody Dirty Dancing. Yeah. When she wore those shorts with the striped, little striped shirt. It was so cute in her little white tennies. That's what I wore as Cindy. Like, yeah. My, through my, I guess through my late 20s and early 30s. That's yeah. what I wore. So, um, yeah, then we would fringe it, you know. And, of course, they'd be a lot shorter. They'd be like this mine. short. I always but... rolled mine. So, these puppies are going bye-bye when they're $55. Heck no. Heck no, I'll cut my sweatpants before I'll spend $55 on a pair of sweat shorts. <laughs> All right. Next thing is my... You don't cut them even in your walk and you're like, you're like this. <laughs> I cut my sweatpants. Right, no. One leg is like just off from the other one. <laughs> yeah, one hand is rolled about this big. The other one is this Or... Big. You cut it long in the front, so when you go to roll it back, you barely can turn it up because you cut it too short yeah. in the back. And, well, Bermuda sweatpants would be, all I'd have to do is really just pull them up above my knee. Who am I kidding? Get those ones with the elastic? <laughs> yeah. All right. So here's a top from Molly and Isadora. It's I like their very, stuff. very cute. That I, looks really nice on you in the picture. I too. really like, if you look at it, it's got like this split and it's lo a little bit longer in the back and very blousey. I like how blousey mm -hmm. it is because her boobs make it come down and then it comes down straight. So it's a great pouch hider. Yeah, and I and I it clings a little bit in the back, but when you got yeah, a big old booty like a, I do, you it's, can throw a sweater <laughs> over it. <clears throat> yeah, and I probably would wear this more around the house, but, yeah, but I think that'd be really cute to work, Cindy. I oh, I know, with a jean work. jacket yeah. or a white jean jacket or a For blue sure. sweater Not or white something. It's too creamy, but but I really think I'm going to keep this, and I like the sleeves because they're it's not long, that long cap enough. sleeves. Yeah, they. they so came how down. much is this? That's not bad. That's only thirty five dollars. Oh, really? It's very very soft. In one video, I said you didn't say the price, and you go, yes, I did. It's. 
Starry Pod or whatever it was. And I'm like, no, she didn't. And I listened in the video and then all the comments were, she did say the prize. I'm like, oh, <laughs> damn it. All right, so I think that this is going to be a keeper for sure. Yeah, I like that on you. I thought it looked really pretty. And I see the concept she was doing with my, with the golds and the blues. And I mean, this would have looked cute together, but it, they're too short. And then I got a Daniel Rain, and I'm like, oh, Those God. Those are so expensive, but this one isn't bad. It's only 50 bucks, $49. So I'm not even sure if I like this or not. I don't like the birds. You got to really like birds to wear them on your clothes. These aren't birds, Debbie. They're, they're pears. They're birds. They're pears. Oh, they're, I thought they were birds. No, they're I pears. They were birds. Oh, my God. They're pears. <laughs> She's like, I don't like the birds. And I I'm don't like, like birds. birds on my clothes. And I'm like, birds? I didn't even see birds on here. They're pears. <laughs> but I really like the front of this. You know, it's kind of got they're that pears. boho they feel. Like birds. So this is really, really, really iffy on me. I thought it looked nice on mm, you. I'm not real know. big on the sleeveless shirts. I hate I hate the way my arms look. So I, I well, really I would wear never. It. I'm not. I would wear it with either a black sweater, black jean jacket, or a maroon yeah, for sure. sweater or for sure. something. It would be pretty. But I don't know. What do you guys think of this shirt? I know it's a little you know, clingy the pear in the back. To bird shirt. <laughs> yeah, it's a little <laughs> clingy in the back, and for forty nine dollars. But see, I a lot know. of your, truth be told, a lot of your shirts cling in the back. I know, but I'm just saying booty. that it's, I don't know. And that is a pretty good price for Daniel Ray, because yeah. Stitch Fix charges yes, 70, like 70, 70 and $80 yes, for Daniel for sure. Ray. So that's kind of iffy. So let me know below. Nah, I don't think that suits you or whatever. Because it is kind of a funky gold color so when you look at this top this yeah, is always a pretty say, i don't like buying stuff i already have you don't have that cool color in your wardrobe no i do not but the difference this is kind of like a greenish greenish hue. gold yeah yeah and i oh i'm a sucker for white button down shirts and i'm still looking for the perfect white fitted plus size shirt and she knows that and she sent me it's like oh i found this lightweight white button up shirt for you and it's by mm lafleur Le Fleur. And it is very lightweight. You can tell that it's very it's well made. $59. You can tell it's very well made. And but I don't it's like the more... white shirts that wrinkle that easily though. Oh, I don't mind that as much, but this it's is like a shirt you, just you can't out of tuck bed. in, but you can't tuck this in. And not that I would, but <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? So why it, is that a complaint of yours? Because you it's it so anyway. long and it's got the slit. And the wide cuffed, you know, the wide hem. So it's really made to wear with like skinny jeans. Well, why wouldn't you? Or you leggings. Could wear, well, you could wear that with leggings with the same color turtleneck all winter long. You could wear it in the spring, summer, and winter. Yeah. What do you guys think? It might be a little bit big on me too. I'm not sure. When you guys look at it, just tell me because honestly... The way I look at it and the way that... Hey, for $59, if you don't like it, just send it back. Yeah. I like it. I just don't know how often I'll wear it because it's so long and I don't have... I don't have the option of tucking it in. Do you know what I mean? Not that I want to, but I like to have that option. Because if I want to tuck it in and then kind of blouse it out a little bit, I can't because there's too much on the bottom of this... And I think M.M. LaFleur is an expensive um, brand, but this is the M.M. LaFleur for Dia and Company. So this is something Dia. that they're making for Dia. Dia and Co. Yeah. Okay. That's how she says Dia and Co. <laughs> All right. So now here is a pair of shorts that are really, really cute. Look at these. I like the hem. I like the distressing. But you're looking at me right now and <laughs> I just couldn't button them. I said, Cindy, you're not actually going to put those, put yourself on this video with those, with your shorts on zip. She goes, yeah, they will see me. I used to be a 20. Now I'm an 18. But this is, it says 1X, but this is like a size 16. So, unfortunately, these have to go back and you can clearly see why. <laughs> and I don't want to go up in size because I know by the time I get them, summer's almost over. And then who knows what size I'm going to be at next 
Yeah, summer. Cindy vacillates between three sizes all year long. Yeah, and I was doing really, really, really good until my knee hit and then I had to quit working out. I basically have to sit, I'll wash the dishes and then I gotta go ice my knee and then I gotta make my bed and then go ice my knee. I, I'm not complaining, I'm just <laughs> saying I, I'm not able to go to the gym, so I can't. I can't do squats. No, I seriously, can't do anything. She was in, she's in a lot of pain with this knee. Yeah, so I'm getting through it. So tell me what the whole total would be. So if you were to keep all five pieces, which you're not. No. The total box is two thirty seven. Not bad. And they give you twenty five percent off, so you should get fifty nine twenty five off the total. So that would leave her at one seventy seven seventy five for five pieces, which is kind of what I like my boxes at. I still think that's be. a little bit high for what they sent. Yeah. Um. So I think. I think the only thing that I'm, cons well, I'm definitely keeping the shirt, but you guys have to let me know about this shirt and this shirt. No, put that, well, you don't even like that one and you have white shirts already. That's very true. The jeans have to go back because they're too small. I'm definitely keeping this shirt, but I need your here advice. Is, is the pear, the pear bird the shirt. The bird shirt? The bird so, pear shirt. Let me know what you guys think, if you even like it. And be honest, I don't care. You can say, no, it looks horrible on you. Great, thank you. I, I We give our honest opinions, and most of you give your, well, I should say, I don't know if they're honest or not, but I really need your honest opinions. If they're opinions. not honest, they're kind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All know, right. I a couple of people that like to leave those nasty ones, but that's okay. That's I don't part mind when people, like, leave us a comment like, you know, hey, you really need to do this or you shouldn't do that or maybe try that. I love constructive criticism. I really do. And when something's not right, I like when they say, hey, maybe you shouldn't have your lights in the ceiling on with the white lights, you know, in the she background. She was telling me, too, she read some comments about a fly in my hair. I guess it was a fly buzzing my head in the, when we were doing a video. And somebody, I didn't even notice it. Somebody was commenting on it, and all you guys kind of jumped <laughs> <laughs> Jumped on her for commenting. <laughs> that was so funny. Thank you, though. Thank you for coming to my defense. All right. Well, that was my Dia and Co. box. So I need a little help. Need a little advice. It wasn't a bad box. I like the concept. I like what they tried to do. I see for the second the, time. I or see it. Time she said it. I'm trying to just tell you that I'm not upset by the box, but. Amber, you did a lovely job. Thank you, Just Amber. a little bit small, so. Yeah. You might sell a shirt or two to her, so. <laughs> even, even one piece is better than sending it all back. Very true. All right, well, thanks so much for hanging out with us. Um, hit the subscribe button. Guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.